The increase in security threats across the world has facilitated the introduction of technology to assist security agencies. Security agents are using surveillance systems such as closed-circuit television or CCTV to enhance safety precautions to the public. Homeowner Association, also known as HOAS, can benefit from HOA video surveillance system in many different ways. HOA security camera system can provide comprehensive peace of mind for gated homeowners association communities and enhance their overall security. There is nothing more important than a safe and secure home. If you want to be certain about your life's safety, protect your properties and eliminate crimes in your community, Falcon Security System is here to help you. CCTV or closed circuit television is a TV system in which signals are not publicly distributed but are monitored primarily for surveillance and security purposes. CCTV relies on strategic placement of cameras and observation of the camera's input on monitors somewhere. How do convex mirrors work in CCTV cameras? With a better field of vision, convex mirrors are perfectly put in tandem with the CCTV system. Convex mirrors are sometimes called diverging mirrors, fish eye mirrors, or dome mirrors. The reflective surface bulges outwards toward the light source which results in a distorted image but an expanded field of view. It is the wide angle of view which makes convex mirrors highly suitable for security applications in the subdivision. There are a variety of convex mirrors that we can install in your subdivision, either a circular or rectangular shape, thanks to the materials utilized for these curved mirrors. They can give out a virtual image that is both defined and clear. However, there are still areas and corners that are referred to as blind spots. A blind spot is an area that is beyond a point of view. Convex mirrors are useful for your security and your safety. Materials used for convex mirrors are notably lightweight and durable. How does lenses work when it comes to installing a CCTV camera? A CCTV lens is a camera's window on the world, said Simon Lambert. Every lens should create a clear image of the scene for the camera to turn into a video. In a security camera, a converging lens, also known as a convex lens, is employed. A convex lens is a lens that converges rays of light traveling parallel to its principal axis. Security camera lenses have two types, the fixed and bar focal. A CCTV security camera that has a fixed lens is permanently set, meaning that its angle of view, focal length, and level of zoom cannot be changed. The focal length is the distance between the center of a lens or curved mirror and its focus. On the other hand, varifocal length has adjustable focal length and allow us more flexibility with the camera placement as well as a greater control over the focus clarity of the specific camera. Here are some examples of the most popular lens types to show you the angle of view you'll obtain. First is a 2.8mm lens with an 81 degree angle of view. It is a popular choice for static camera surveillance. It can cover a large area with one camera installed in a corner to monitor an entire street. Next is a 4mm lens with a 62 degrees angle of view that provides higher clarity of a greater distance. The key distinction is the decreased angle of vision which creates the appearance that objects are closer to the camera. And this lens is frequently employed in outdoor location. And lastly, a 6mm lens for 43 degrees telephoto view provides a limited but detailed distance picture. Although it has more clarity at further distance, the 4mm lens shows a similar scene to 2.8mm. 
The main difference is the reduced angle of view which gives us the illusion that the objects are closer to the camera. A 4mm lens is useful to detection and identification. This video shows the above three lens sizes with the subject at a 16 meters distance from the camera. Now here is the table that shows each lens size and its equivalent angle of view and maximum distance. This means that a lens with a larger focal length will have higher magnification and a narrower angle of view. Whereas, a lens with a shorter focal length will have lower magnification and a wider angle of view. In finding the angle of view, we can use the formula theta equals 2 arc tangent of h over 2f. Theta is equal to the angle of view. h is the CCD size, which is one-third, that is equal to 4.8 millimeters and F is the focal length or the lens size. Now, let us compute the angle of view of 2.8 millimeter lens size using the formula. Theta equals two arc tangent of 4.8 millimeters divided by two times 2.8 millimeters, which is the lens size. Solving the equation by using a calculator gives an answer of 81 degrees as the angle of view. Now, let's talk about the different types of cameras that our company has to offer. We are happy to tell you that we have three of the best security cameras on the market that you can choose from. First is the Bullet CCTV. It is one of the most recognizable type of CCTV that is typically small and shaped like a revolved bullet shell or lipstick case. Bullet cameras can easily mount to street posts because most of them use the tri-axis type of mount. It is highly visible so that it can act as deterrent, resist to dirt in challenging environments. It provides surveillance over long distance. Here are the technical specifications for bullet CCTV. Next is the infrared or night vision camera CCTVs. With the word infrared itself, meaning below red, Infrared security cameras have the capability to capture videos in no light or low light areas. When the camera detects that it's sufficiently dark, these bulbs will turn on and flood the area with infrared light, allowing the cameras to record footage in the dark. Infrared can see not only in the dark but through fogs, dust, and smoke. Here are the technical specifications for infrared or night vision camera CCTV. Lastly is the license plate capture cameras, also known as license plate recognition or LPR cameras, are a specialized type of video surveillance camera designed to capture numbers and letters of license plates on steel or moving vehicles. Regular security cameras typically cannot compensate for these variables to capture a usable video that identifies license plate numbers. Here are the specifications for the LPR CCTV cameras. Bullet CCTV cameras are best placed on street posts where the height allows us better vantage point of your subdivision. The most appropriate height at which you should install your surveillance camera is 7 to 8 feet. It is just above the easy reach of vandal or potential robber and close enough to ground to capture paces and valuable information. The best places to install an infrared CCTV are in the places that are not well lighted such as the streets with no street lights. This is because infrared cameras can capture acceptable video in total darkness and even better quality videos in low light. An LPR system is typically set up at the gated entrance of a HOA or HOA. This concept also applies to most other types of residentials or commercial gated access communities. This is so that the license plate numbers are immediately recognizable if a crime was committed inside the gated community. To find out how effective the coverage area of our CCTV cameras are, we must first calculate the distance between two CCTV units. This is the vicinity map of the Donakai 11 subdivision 
as well as the illustration of the coordinate plane. We will be using the line segment AB to compute the distance since it has the longest range. In finding the distance between two points A and B, we will use the formula AB equals the square root of x2 minus x1 squared plus y2 minus y1 squared. Substitute the formula with the coordinates of point A, which is negative 1 and 3, and the coordinates of point B, which is 1 and negative 3. If we simply follow the formula as listed, we will get an answer of 6.32 meters. This shows that our camera units have effective coverage because our CCTV cameras can detect movements at a maximum range of 20 meters. That means there will be no blind spots in your subdivision. That's all for today. We, Falcon Security System, would like to thank all the wonderful people who participated in making this project possible. It is our pleasure to help and make sure that the homeowners of Donak 11 subdivision are safe and protected 24-7. We will appreciate it if you will avail our services so we can extend our help and maintain a safe environment. That's all. Thank you. Falcon Security Systems. Your security is our highest priority.